I remember one day sitting, it was a Friday afternoon, we were a group of pastors together in the one home, just praying and encouraging one another. And the pastor in whose home we were gathered came running in. He said, guys, guys, you've got to help. Three doors up, there's a man who's breaking his furniture and destroying his home. They looked at one another all uptight. And then one of the pastors said, Pastor Henry, you go. And so I said, all right, I'll go. I used to box at school. I could defend myself, but I didn't know what the situation would be when I got there. And so I just prayed and I said, Lord, you just show me what to do here. And I could hear the noise of breaking furniture. And I opened the front door and as I walked into that house, God just laid it into my heart. As I entered the dining room, I grabbed the nearest chair and I lifted it above my head and I said, I've come to help you break up your home. Immediately, the man stopped, looked at me, put down the hammer that he was smashing a sideboard with. But I could see he was under the influence of alcohol. You never try and counsel a person like that then. But just then his dog, great big Alsatian, got involved in a massive fight with a neighboring dog. And I said to him, I'll go and fetch my car and I'll take you and your dog to the vet, which is what I did. But I went back the next day and he was stone cold sober. And I led him lovingly into the arms of Jesus. He changed his life. You know, God is never early, he's never late, he's just on time. Because although that man had lost his wife to cancer two weeks before I met with him, a month later he was killed in a crossroad accident. But I know where he is. I wonder if you know who you are this morning. Are you safe in the arms of Jesus?